Alhamdulillah, Sassam Asulna. Tonight we're celebrating the best of the British sport, but the British spirit. Tonight we're celebrating MCV. In honor of its 15th anniversary and the bonding of the Muslim community. If you come with me on the stage. Tonight I'm celebrating and honored to be next to my best friends who are with me. I've not met them for a long, long time. I'm celebrating being amongst them. Okay? That's why I'm honored to stand amongst you. The challenges on MCD and us are great. I'm not going to talk about sport because I'm not a sportsman. I used to play uh, Belly. What's Belly in Arabic? Marble. Deep drop. And uh, talk about leadership. I'm very irritated for the world leadership. I don't like it. I hate it. We have to call ourselves seven. The servant is the one that his community or his community make him or her a leader. That's why I'm not celebrating the world leadership. I'm celebrating the world servant. About Islam, I'm a very proud to be a Muslim. But who is the friends of Islam and Muslims? And who are the enemies? Are the non-Muslims are our enemies, or are we the enemies of Islam? Who could be the first enemy to Islam? And Bashar Muhammad Ghazali, the great scholar from Egypt, he said, well, people are the most incredible and fierce enemy to Islam from amongst what's so called Muslim Imams, or Muslim scholars, or Muslim Muslims. But they don't know what they are talking about. And this is a challenge for MCB now, tomorrow, and for the generations to come. And Allah said, let Ahsan talk to people softly, softly. So you can change your enemy to a friend. We talk to our imams. To be living in the contemporary world. Know the contemporary language. And know the contemporary technology and leave the contemporary society. Here is a message to MCD. We celebrate the absence of women from our mosque. While the greatest woman in humanity who led Islam was there from day one. And Lady Khadija was an icon not only for the Arabs or the Qurayshite, but for humanity. For our mosque, we must allow women to come, not to become a leader, or a chairman, or a member of the board, but a servant. For Allah, what the Prophet said, do not ever prevent the female still of Allah from coming to the mosque and the house of Allah. Not to the mosque or the house of the tribe, or the sect, or the group. And this is a challenge for NC. Too many challenges. I came from a glass house to fight. I don't know what glass house means. <laughs> I came to a democratic society which does not have any ceiling. Because democracy has no ceiling and no boundaries. But sometimes you live in a democratic society and they found that you are living in a glass ceiling society. So from last house culture to our last civil society, we need to review our democracy and see how high we have glass ceiling or how low we have glass ceiling. The issue of the cat. I'm talking about issues for MCB. Sorry, Brother Farouk, I speak my heart. 
The heart is the most dynamic act of worshiping Allah. But we reduce it to the culture of the village, the culture of the avenue, and the culture of the ghetto. The cat is for humanity, for Muslims and for non Muslims. Should be empowering people, should be helping people, should be saving people, should be training people. Our society has to understand that if we are going to create what we so called leadership, we we'll have to train, educate, empower the society, youth, women, and men. Three partners of the society. We are not a unisex society, we are a diverse society. So the people who say do not spend the money of the cat on training, on the people who work in the cat, the fifth has to be questioned heavily. Because when Allah says that Lamina Alayha and Fisabillah do not stand and try to make Another human interpretation of what Allah said. We talk about Hafiz and Ayah. We are very proud to have many thousands of Hafiz, but we don't make Ayah. And it's another challenge. One Ayah would be more important than many Hafiz. Ayah can save, guide, and build society. Hafiz can recite, which is good but not good enough. And this is a challenge for our community to our community. Because we are living here in an open society, democratic society, to build a better society and save humanity. Policy. The Farouk Murad talked about policy, impacting the policy. But I'm talking about becoming policy names. Think tanks. Our community does not believe to spend money from zakat, or from sadaqa, or from lillah to make think tanks. We should come out of the traditional isms to the independence reasoning they have. The renewal of the blood of the generation of the society and our community and the humanity as a whole. Without ishtihad and tajdeed will always be traditional. And you cannot claim that you follow the Prophet Because he was the one who was seeing the vision for humanity while he was sitting at the shade of Kaaba in Mecca, being tortured and surrounded by the enemies who wanted to kill him in his field. And the vision has to be a duty or a compelling duty, a compelling duty found on every Muslim, male and female, as partners of the society. Research and administration, no fund for it. Why should MCB cry for funding? Because we don't believe in it. We don't believe in making an umbrella to save the Muslims. And this is the kind of ghetto mentality we might be having in a society who is living in the most open country on earth. <coughs> Celebration has to be coming from the different direction of our community. I mentioned the role of youth because I visited the Udiran Kumar. We have been affected very much by the spirit of the spring. Is it a No. Yeah, the is playing. I've been to Cairo for about 15 times in one year. Never happened in my life. To Libya, seven times in one year. Tunisia, three times. Somalia, four times. Kenya, three times. The spirit is coming. We want the spirit to come from here to there. But really, it is the youth that we are ignoring or the youth, that we are using them as a piece of decoration for fundraising, 
okay, who made it, who's up in heart, up in mind, kept being killed and tortured to save the humanity, not to save Egypt, Tunisia, and Yemen, and others. They are saving us here because they are bringing a new spirit to humanity. It's coming from the youth with us. So what we need to do now to conclude is to have a tsunami of change, a volcano of change, an earthquake of change. If I'm a leader and I am in my seat for the last 25 years, I should go peacefully. If I'm a leader and I'm dictating to my society, I should go peacefully. Otherwise, the youth will throw me away. When I did it to the Islamic League four years ago, I love you. <laughs> People thought that must be something wrong. I have stolen some money. Or there was some problem of sexual harassment that had been signed. It's not clear that somebody has to move on. And I'm celebrating another spirit of the one who founded Muslim music. Sorry, sorry it's one of the left. I think for people. <laughs> who, who founded Muslim news headline. His name is Muhammad Sadi Mamdani. That's right. He established an organization, built it in five years, then he went ahead and left it for the community to own it. Community ownership is what we are looking for. If we allow our idea to be owned by the community, it will become ideology, culture, and civilization. But if we strangle it because we are jama'ah, or because of an organization, or a family, or individuals, it will die before we die. And you celebrate Muhammad, although most of you said mine, and he's going to be another. What I'm trying about the tsunami of change, we want positive social climate change. And we can make it, not we can, but we will. It. If we believe in what we can do because we will do it. Belief is the cornerstone of any success. I was very touched by your speech, Baroness, because she showed us that nobody can stop a human being from achieving what he or she can do because of the power of belief in your heart. Thank you for coming to inspire us. So, I have to stop, isn't it? <laughs> we celebrate that we can together make the positive social climate change and we'll start from the top and tell them peace be avenue enough with the youth to come and live with the woman come and clean, let everyone become and clean. Let's become a, like a community-based organization. I'm very proud to stand here, and this is my community. Tell them who are this community, brother. You tell them, not tell the audience. No, you, 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 you. Come here. <laughs> tell them, it's my community. Tell them who are here. the audience. Yeah. You. It's the uh, uh, Death of Muslim UK uh, group that's with you this evening. Thank you, Dr. Honey.